What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power Play with CJ. I just want to focus in on Islanders prospect Josh Hosang. And, uh, you know, he's made some interesting comments in the press, let's call it, um, about not being invited to the Canadian World Junior Camp. Um, you know, and quite frankly, he made a very good point. He's a controversial figure. Let's call it what it is. Uh, I'm not judging the kid. In fact, I really like him, and you guys will hear about that in a second. But going a step further. If they brought him to camp and he lit it up, then they'd have to have him on the World Junior Team, right? I mean, and I believe he was fifth in underage scores in the OHL last year, and he did it on a pretty, pretty bad Winter Spitfires team. So, yeah. He's good. He He's a very, very good, just all-around skilled hockey player. And uh, he's, you know, said some pretty... You know, controver I mean, controversial. He wants to lead the NHL in points in three or four years. I mean, okay, that's kind of a lofty goal, kid. But all right, you know, you can't encourage kids to have goals and then be pissed off when they have big goals. It just doesn't work that way. And um, you know, the, I thought the Islanders made a good pick taking him at the end of the uh, first round. You know, I think he's got what it takes to be a dynamic offensive player at the next level. Does he need to get a you know a little bit of attitude adjustment? Yeah. But here's the thing: I was watching. The uh, Monday Night Football game last night, and, you know, Johnny Manziel flipped off the wash I love that. I love that, you know, just kind of so often you get these guys that are just, you know, we played hard, the other team played hard, and there's no pizzazz to them. But, I mean, you guys like Manziel, guys, I'm not even comparing them as players, but guys that just bring it and, you know, tell it like it is. And, you know, um, I thought it was great. Ben Scrivens, you know, the professor, Cornell guy, uh, tweeted at him, preach, and, uh, you know, hey, keep talking, kid. You know, it's really, um, you know, that's that's good. That, that's what I, I love it. You know, I hope he keeps telling tell it like it is. You know, he's an 18-year-old kid. It's good to have confidence. You know, maybe you got to find a happy medium between being boring and being confident. But, you know what, for now, screw it. You know, might as well just keep doing you, kid. And, uh, you know, I think he's going to keep doing that. He's going to let one of the guys doesn't care what anyone else thinks. He's going to let you know. And um, I think the sports world on the whole needs guys like that. That give you some pizzazz on the ice and some uh, some nice uh, you know sound bites off the ice. So I think he's gonna be a guy you um, you keep hearing about for a while because his skills and his um, you know attitude. I don't say attitude negative. We just what it is. Um, will definitely help him become a uh, guy you hear about a lot going forward. Anyway, that's on this episode of the Power Play with CJ on Josh Osang's comments and why I love the kid. Stay tuned for episodes for the off season and beyond. Later, guys.